जय स्वामी नारायण डियर स्टूडेंट्स डू यू एवर प्ले क्रिकेट अफकोर्स यू माइट बी प्लेइंग क्रिकेट ऑल्सो यू माइट बी वॉचिंग आई पी एल ऑल्सो इज एंट इट माई डियर स्टूडेंट्स टूडे आई वुड लाइक टू प्रेजेंट ए पावरफुल लेसन विद द एग्जाम्पल ऑफ क्रिकेट वट इज अ गेम ऑफ क्रिकेट वन बॉलर थ्रोज अ बॉल एंड वन बैट्समैन हिट्स दैट बॉल एंड देर आर लेवन प्लेयर्स फील्डिंग ऑन द ग्राउंड to stop that ball but still if that ball crosses the boundary he gets four runs and if that ball crosses the boundary without bouncing on the ground he gets the six runs based on the performance of batsmen bowlers and fielders audience will either applaud them or criticize them similarly my dear students life is also like cricket every day life throws different kinds of situations at you how do you hit those situations how do you respond to those situation how do you react to those situations that will determine either your rewards or punishments in the cricket how bowler throws a ball it's not in the control of a batsman what is in the control of batsman how he can hit that ball similar in our life also situations circumstances people they are not in our control what is in our control how do we respond to them that is what in our control that's why in shrimad bhagavad gita lord krishna said karmanya vadikaraste ma phaleshu kadacha we have 100% right and freedom only in our karma in our duty in our responses to the people circumstances situations we don't have control over the consequences over the circumstances how do we judge people do you know that how do we judge people how do we judge the character of people based on their reactions and responses to the situations how do you react how do you respond to the situation circumstances that define your character your personality and remember you don't become great by chance you become great by choice what you choose defines your character and personality in ramayan lord ram gets a sudden 14 years of vanvas can you imagine that situation tomorrow lord ram is going to become the king of ayodhya and this night everything changed he has to go for the 14 years of vanvas can anybody digest such a sudden situation but see the amazing response of lord ram to this situation he didn't complain he didn't take objection that what is my fault how can you give me this 14 years of vanvas no he didn't take any objection he didn't complain instead he thanked to mother kaikai that you have given me the greater kingdom than ayodhya tomorrow i will be able to serve rushi muni i will be able to protect tribal people tomorrow i will be able to kill demons you gave me the greater kingdom than ayodhya this is not an ordinary response later in rama and we also know that lord ram sent sita ji to the jungle sita ji also could have asked that what is my fault but sita ji didn't complain didn't take objection didn't ask like this and see the response of Sita ji Sita ji is worried about Lord Ram but Sita ji has no complaint about Lord Ram So how worst situation happens in your life doesn't count But how best response you give to that situation that counts in our life Sachin Tendulkar who is the legendary cricketer from India who is known as a god of cricket when he was playing his first match he got hit with the ball on his face and face was profusely bleeding everybody gathered his coach said that okay let us go for the alternative player at that moment at that situation sachin tendulkar said that no i will play no i will play this choice this response to this situation made him a legendary cricketer So how do you respond to these situations makes you legendary or average Ratan Tata one of the most renowned Indian businessman and philanthropist in 2008 when terrorist 
attacked on Mumbai Taj Mahal Palace Hotel. Ratan Tata responded to this situation in a different way. At that time he was in USA, immediately he flew back to Mumbai and he himself personally oversaw all these recovery efforts. He paid the salaries to his hotel staff for next six months. Even he helped the surrounding people who got injured, who faced the damages. Situation was not in his control, but response was in his control. And response makes men great. Nelson Mandela. Mandela spent his 27 years in the prison for his political activism. 27 years. Can you imagine? Almost double to 14 years. 27 years he was in the jail, but when he came out, he responded to this situation with forgiveness and reconciliation. He didn't go angry. He didn't go negative. He dealt this situation with forgiveness and with big heart. Now my question to you is, how would you respond when you fail in your work? When people criticize you? When you lose your job? When you lose money? When your friends become your enemies? When your friends betray you? When your own brother breaks your trust? When people cheat you? When your family go against you? When people question your character? When people insult you, when people ignore you, when people reject you, when you get accident, etc, etc. In these situations, will you give thoughtless reaction or thoughtful response? Now the main question is, on what basis should one respond to the situations? This is very very important question for the life. The answer of this question, simply given in our Veda and Upanishadha with the two words, Dharmam Chara Follow Dharma Whatever situation you face in your life you have to respond based on values not based on emotions you have to respond each and every situation keeping values and Dharma at the center keeping God at the center then you can create the wonderful response to any situation now, how can you design your responses still more better? My dear students, here I would like to present four powerful tips to design your response in a great way. What are those four powerful tips? Number one, learn from the legends. Till now, whatever legendary people you know, how they are making choices, how they are responding to the situations, learn from the legends. Number two, read the Vedic scriptures by reading scriptures like Siksha Patri, Srimad Bhagavad Gita, Vachnamrutam, Srimad Bhagavad Puran, many other such Vedic scriptures you can read by reading them, by listening the stories from them you can understand that in this situation how should I respond number three listen to the satsang of true saints when you listen the satsang you get the ideas how to make choices in your life and number four learn from your own experiences you also are living life you also get so many experience keep that learning mindset so that you can learn from each and every experience and you can make your responses more better so my dear students let us respond to each and every situation based on values based on dharma based on god and let us live a legendary life like lord sri ram thank you Jai Swami Narayan.